His teammate is Gary Martin, the youth movement for Vin Lanana. The freshman is having a phenomenal year, making his indoor championship debut. And you talk about championship experience, that's Thomas Van Oppen of Wake Forest. The graduate student entered this week the fastest mile in the ACC, registered at the Valentine in Boston a few weeks ago at 354.85. The, the mile depth is incredible, uh, especially this year of 2023 with 90-something runners in the NCAA having broken four minutes. Virginia has their share of them, that's for sure. Gary Martin was the high school superstar of 2023 indoor and outdoor season. Now he's a calf. Virginia with a high number of runners in this final. Five Cavaliers represented with Jack Eliason, James Donahue, Wes Porter, Gary Martin, and Nathan Mountain. Pushing, little shoving, jock as they get ready for the pull. You're going to see a lot of Virginia white over navy blue. Virginia in the lead right now. Some of the other Cavs hanging back just a bit. But Thomas Van Oppen in second. And you think that he ran 354.85 for about 30 years. The meet record in the ACC was 355. That went down with Magoose ran 355.6 in 2020. Now Van Oppen, certainly with the opportunity, if he's more aggressive than he is right now, to run that fast. We went out in 57.9, so that fast pace being set by one of the Cavaliers is yeah. uh, is amazing. Yeah, that's Nathan Mountain out there who is right now the pace setter for UVA, part of the strong recruiting class a couple of years ago, one of the best seasons in Ohio high school history from his days at St. Xavier in Cincinnati. Nathan Mountain specializes in the steeplechase outdoors. And he's running a great pace now. He went through 600 and 128, 660 yards and 128. So he's way below four minute pace. No one's kind of going with him. These mile finals tend to be a bit more tactical. Not that they're running slow. They're just not running as fast as Mountain is right now. And I think Gary Martin just moved into second. Yep. The bespeckled Gary Martin. And here comes Van Oppen getting on Martin's shoulders. This is where the race is. Mountain will not finish this. Martin making a move. Here comes the Australian as well, Jesse Hunt, as he has shoveled his way up near the front of the pack. 158.6 up front. That's 355.6 pace. So he's running right at meet record pace. By the way, that's also the number 16 time in the country. So there it is. Those six individuals, four of whom are from Virginia. And then there's, of course, Hunt of North Carolina and Van Oppen of Wake Forest. The win is probably coming from that group. They go through the kilometer in about 2.30, so they're still running four-minute pace or faster. Gary Martin on the back straightaway, sitting second for the Cavaliers, the freshman from Warminster. He set the Virginia record for the fastest indoor time in this race, a 3.55 earlier this year. And now Van Oppen and Hunt going after the leader. How much longer is Mountain going to stay in there? Is he going to try and steal the thing from up front? He's got two laps to go. He hasn't backed off yet. Gap Three. starting to close just a little bit. Three flat point five with two to go. Mountain beginning to fade. Here comes Van Oppen. Here comes Hunt and the rest of the pack. All Virginia guys. We got five Virginia guys in the top eight right now. And it looks like Porter. Porter is going to be the lead calf after they go by Mountain. Van Oppen, Hunt, Porter, one to go. This will be a great last lap. Van Oppen with the advantage of having a 354 under his belt and the confidence that goes with it. Hunt, though, going for the win. Van Oppen and Hunt back and forth on the back straight away, and here comes Jesse Hunt. He had a look of confidence about him yesterday in the prelims from Perth, Western Australia. Look at the kick to bring it home. North Carolina is going to sweep the women's and the men's mile. What a feather in the cap for Coach Chris Miltenberg of UNC. Hunt, last lap, 27-12.
fantastic finish. Van Oppen kicked 27-9, so that wasn't too bad either, but Hunt with a decisive move. He waited until the final turn and then pounced. And here's down the home stretch for the win. Jesse Hunt, North Carolina. Three runners sub four minute today. Hunt with a 358-46. He's with Haley. Thanks, Sean. Jesse, you really held your pace strong there at the end. How are you able to come back and get the win? Yeah, look, it was a fast pace from the start. Virginia had five people in there, so credit to everyone else in the race as well. It was a great race, and yeah, just bided my time, and when, it, when I went, it just, just went, so. Yesterday, we talked about how last year you lost this race by just a second. I could tell you were not about to let that happen again. How extra fulfilling does that make this ACC win? Oh, look, it's great. I mean, it's my last ACC indoors. So to go out like this is, is amazing and just to do it for my team is, is great. So really appreciate everyone and hi to mom and dad back in Australia. <laughs> Congratulations, fun to watch you. Thank you very much. Sean. Well, there was no mistake this year. He was gonna win it and he had that mindset arriving here in this beautiful facility.